Here we have a fixture that I made to cut the profile of a wheel all in one setup. Come over here and you can see the cutters. The big cutter right here does the tread. You got the radius for the fillet and this angle right here for the flange. This cutter right here does the diameter for the flange. This cutter up here does the 10 degrees on the back side. To begin, you have to have a stop over here for the carriage, and then the compound you put on 3 degrees, and bring this to the stop. Turn this in until the cutter, you can see way over here, goes right into the fillet and you set this at zero here and the compound over here is also zero. Then with the lathe turning you back it off, you turn in 10 and you come in and you make a, a cut. When you're making a cut you're cutting the tread and the flange at the same time, three sixteenths apart. And you keep turning it in until your desired diameter. So this tread would be zero degrees and you can measure it easily for the tread diameter. Once you're happy with that, you reset this back to zero. Now you take your compound and wind it back and you'll see the cutter is coming off of the tread turning the three degrees. And when you get to the end turn the other handle to go around the corner to get that rounded edge on the end. Then you come back here and turn this diameter radius on the flange. Then you come in here and you set both of them at zero then wind this and you can see it starts cutting the back side. After you make a pass you pull it out, you bring it over here and you turn this radius for the flange and then you back this off to park it. Don't need that anymore. And then you take your file and file the flange nice in the tread. And you're done. And you can do a wheel in about five minutes.